Hi, I'm sorry I missed class today. I wanted to just go over uh, the review sheet for the test on Thursday. Um, the first thing is the Ashray unit. So the Gemara and Daftal um, those lines about Ashray, that's all in the booklet. Um, just I highlighted a couple of points. First of all, the structure, the Mivna of Ashray, um, where all the parts of Ashray come from in Tehillim. The uh, first psukim that are introductory from different places. Um, we also talked about the importance of Ashrei and the explanation of the Meshachachma, how the integration of the Alephet order plus Potecha Chotecha has to do with God nourishing the world through nature. Um, just a couple of points in the language of the Gemara that were important was Amar Amar, that when you have this double Amar, it's one person said the name of somebody else, Amar B'Shem. And the sequence of Elaima and Ella. If you say that it's because it's alphabet order, then it can't be Ella, rather it's something else. This sequence of the structure where Elaima suggests a possibility that will be rejected, and the Ella is the, inter the alternative. For this section, you need to know all the words, phrases of the Gemara, and what they mean. The second section of the that we did was Kriyat Shmalamita, and here is Daf Dalam and Bet line 55 on the very bottom of the page until Daf Hayom and Aleph. Um, and I just highlighted a few points that we focused on. The obligation to say Kriyat Shema Lamita, uh, the source, the exemption of the Tamil Chacham, um, the Agadah of the sword with two blades that was um, important that's not inside. This 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 Agadah is not inside if you should know what it, what it says. Um, the Gemara Daf Samach where they introduced Birchad Amapiel and the fact that it's only one parsha of Kriyat Shema for Kriyat Shema The reason that the Yerushalmi gives uh, the ex that Kriyat Shema is because of protection from Azikin and the explanation of the Me'iri. The fact that the Rambam brings the Halacha in Hilchot Tfilah and not Hilchot Kriyat Shema, what that says about how he sees Kriyat Shema Lamita, and the fact that the Rambam puts the priority on Berchot Amapil, that it's more about a Tfilah, um, asking God for mercy, than for uh, saying Shema. Um, we also noted that the Yushalmi, that Rashi quotes, Lamod B'tzfilah and Tochtevei Torah, um, relates to the Gemara Davav that the integration of Talmud Torah with Kriyat Shema is the idea that Talmud Torah puts us in the presence of God, like the Gemara Davav says, that Gemara Davav, um, you don't need to know it inside, but outside, yes, and the connection to Perak Hay, that... Um, the reason why learning is an appropriate introduction to tefillah because it creates a relationship with God and puts us in the presence of God. Um, the third and final section is the Tosfot Um We did the Tosfot, only the part that we did up until the answer of Rabbeinu Tam. Uh, he quotes Rashi, he quotes Rashi's source in the Yerushalmi, the four questions of Tosfot. This is all inside. We did this inside. Um, let me quote and all that um, on the word list, vocabulary, um, the four questions and the answer um, of Tosot. We also talked about how you can answer all of Tosot's questions for Rashi. That according to Tosot, Tzmicha Kilo Tzfilah relates to Kriyat Shema. Um, and you can only fulfill Tzmicha Kilo Tzfilah when you're fulfilling Kriyat Shema. According to Rashi, they could be independent. Um, Um, we talked about the uh, sections of the day of Plag, Hamincha, Mincha Gedola, Mincha Ketana. You should be familiar with those phrases. We did Rabbeinu Yonah, the two answers of Rabbeinu Yonah. Um, one of them was we did in Rabbeinu Yonah in the back end, and one of them we did um, just as quoted in the Shulchan Aruch, who passed like the other interpretation of Rabbeinu Yonah. You should know what a Tzulat Nadava is. This is a typo. Uh, what a Tzulat Nadava is. And this last piece um, we didn't do yet, so I won't worry about it. Um, if you have any questions, you know, email or uh, we'll make some time tomorrow um, before we start learning groups to answer any questions on this. Uh, good luck and I uh, will see you tomorrow.